Welcome everyone to the enchanting world of plants. Today, we're going to delve into the fascinating process of gaseous exchange in plants and explore its importance in the life of these magnificent organisms. Plants may seem stationary, but they're incredibly dynamic organisms, constantly exchanging gases, absorbing nutrients, and responding to their environment in intricate ways. Gaseous exchange is just one of the many marvels of plant biology that make life on Earth possible. Gaseous exchange in plants is vital for their survival, much like how breathing is essential for us humans. Just as we inhale oxygen and exhale carbon dioxide, plants also undergo a similar exchange of gases, albeit through different structures. There are different types of gaseous exchange in plants. This is where the magic happens. The leaf, with its intricate network of veins and tiny pores called stomata, serves as the primary site for gaseous exchange in most plants. Stomata are small openings found on the surface of leaves and stems. They regulate the exchange of gases allowing carbon dioxide to enter the plant for photosynthesis while releasing oxygen and water vapor as byproducts. But, how does this process work exactly? Let's break it down. During the day, when sunlight is plentiful, plants perform photosynthesis, a process where they convert carbon dioxide and water into glucose and oxygen using energy from the sun. Carbon dioxide enters the leaf through the stomata and diffuses into the chloroplasts, where it's used in photosynthesis. Meanwhile, oxygen, the byproduct of photosynthesis, exits the leaf through the same stomata. Second is lenticular exchange. Lenticels are corky, porous structures found on the surface of stems, woody branches, and other periderm tissues of plants. They serve as additional sites for gas exchange, particularly in woody plants where the outer bark forms a protective layer. Lenticels provide a pathway for gases to diffuse between the internal tissues of the plant and the external environment. While not as numerous or efficient as stomata, lenticels play a crucial role in facilitating gaseous exchange especially in older or thicker stems, where stomata may be absent or reduced in number. The last one is exchange through cuticle. The cuticle is a waxy, waterproof layer covering the aerial parts of plants, including leaves, stems, and fruits. While primarily serving as a barrier to prevent water loss, the cuticle also allows for limited gas exchange. Small molecules such as oxygen, carbon dioxide, and water vapor can diffuse through the cuticle, albeit at a slower rate compared to stomata or lenticels. The exchange through cuticle becomes particularly significant in plants with specialized adaptations to arid or water-stressed environments, where minimizing water loss is paramount. Each type of gaseous exchange mechanism in plants plays a crucial role in maintaining optimal physiological functions, supporting photosynthesis, respiration, and overall growth and development. Together, they ensure the efficient exchange of gases necessary for plant survival and ecosystem balance. Did you enjoy this fascinating exploration? If so, show some love by hitting the like button sharing it with your friends, and subscribing to our channel. We appreciate your support and thanks for watching.